Someone saw something and someone knows something. A 15-year-old girl murdered in Youngstown police tonight are frustrated over a lack of help from the community. Good evening. I'm Stan Boney. I'm Lindsay Watson. Nearly 48 hours after Youngstown's fourth homicide of the year, police are being vocal about the need for support from the community. They've looked at video and interviewed witnesses who were there Saturday night at Martha's Boulevard Tavern and still no one has been arrested. So this afternoon, police asked for help from those who were there. First News reporter Jacob Thompson has our top story tonight at 10. There were dozens and dozens of people at this event. Someone saw something and someone knows something. Saturday night around 1030, Youngstown police were called to Martha's Boulevard Tavern on Southern Boulevard. A fight broke out at a birthday party leading to gunfire. 15-year-old Amaya Montserrat was shot and died at the hospital. Now the police are asking for information from anyone that was there. Anonymous tips are great and they can point us in the right direction, but they're not good enough to get a conviction. They're not good enough to get warrants signed. They're not good enough to move forward with our with a case in the direction that we want it to. Police have confirmed there were multiple shooters between the two groups. Lieutenant Mohammed Awad says the conflict between the two groups have been going on for a couple weeks. Captain Jason Simon says people involved in this and recent homicides have been younger. All of those individuals who were killed in addition to some of the arrestees or suspects that we have in mind are all juveniles or very, very young adults. Awad says there were many people at the tavern that weren't involved and says someone needs to say something. I don't recall a situation where a person who's not involved was retaliated against for coming forward and doing the right thing. Youngstown Law Director Jeff Limbian says they will be also going after anyone who is protecting the suspect. If you're thinking about assisting the shooter in some way, understand that you're putting yourself at, at, at great risk of going to prison for the rest of your life. In Youngstown, Jacob Thompson, WKBN 27 First News. You got to take into effect who's killing our kids. It's our kids killing our kids. Community reaction tonight to the young girl's murder and increased violence. 